A driveway that can hold nearly 4,000 gallons of water. You might ask why? Well, it's one of the features designed to help prevent flooding. And it is a feature we found in a new home in a Houston neighborhood hit hard by Harvey. Jason Miles got a closer look. He joins us live from the home. Break it down for us here, Jason. Hey there, Lynn. First, let me set the scene. This is the Bray's Heights neighborhood, Bray's Bayou, not far from us. This is one of those Meyerland area neighborhoods really hit hard by Harvey a little more than one year ago. The home here completely rebuilt, but the most interesting feature may indeed be this driveway. And uh, when we were having our very mild and lovely... From the expansive first floor... You can open this up all the way. ...to the third floor bonus room staged for a little girl's slumber party. And you have great natural light. It's not like you're up in an attic. I could spend this entire story talking about our tour of this fabulous home's interior, but its more practical selling points are on the outside, where flood-tolerant features were built into the design. The level of the deck is the same level as the finished floor of the home. Raising air conditioning units above the floodplain is nothing new, but this driveway is. We're storing water that, that would normally go into the bayou and overwhelm the bayou and the storm sewer system. It's the first time stone acorn builders have used the system. Basically, water flows not off the surface of the driveway like this, but in between the cracks of these pavers. We'll excavate, you know, 14 inches of earth, and then in its place we'll put in rock. And then we'll start with three inches, one inch rock, and then these are called fines, they're real fine pebbles. And then on top of the fines, We'll put the pavers. Water slowly seeps into the soil rather than into storm drains. This driveway can temporarily hold about 3,700 gallons of water. The builders believe that would be billions of gallons of storm water storage if every single family home in Houston had this system. Do you think the anti-flood features will help sell a house like this? I think they will. Sarah Levine and Cass and her brother Benjamin plan to ask just under two million for this Braze Heights beauty which they've branded as a beyond the storm showcase home. You may be asking how much is a driveway like this cost? Well, I'm told about $10,000 more than the average driveway, which is built of concrete and reinforced steel in most cases. By the way, this home will be available for a series of open houses over the next few weekends. They will benefit the Barbara Bush Houston Literacy Foundation. You can find a lot more information on KHOU.com. Guys. Yeah, that's a great cause. Looks like a great home. We'll see what people think when they go check it out. Thanks, Jason.